to the weather. It's June, but yeah, it does not feel like it. Jesse Ritka is here with our forecast. Man, more calendar confusion. We just keep on messing up the months here. February was like, oh, we'll make up for winter. And now June is saying we'll make up for spring. Spring is here, <laughs> or October, whichever you choose. All behind this cold front. We basically we we're in the 70s. It was warm, muggy, feeling like June on the first day of June, and then the cold front swung through on Saturday and brought the colder, drier air into the forecast. At least today, high pressure has pushed away the clouds, so it looks and feels a lot better. We do have another area of low pressure off to the west, though, and that will help keep our temperatures on the cool side. And it has certainly been a very cool and wet start to this entire year, 2013. And we've had the rain and we've had the cool temps. January was above average for temps, but yeah, look at how much precipitable water, how much liquid was in the some of the snow over three inches in January and February. Although temps in February took a nice dip. March, five degrees below average. April, below average as well. So that gives us total so far this year, almost 70 degrees colder to the start to 2013. And really, it is the fourth wettest on record with almost 20 inches of liquid water. Not going to add any liquid to the bucket today. Mostly sunny skies expected. Here's a beautiful look from downtown Kenosha. I feel like Bob Ross painting in some of those happy little clouds. That's the way it's going to stay today. And please enjoy it because temps are going to take a tumble downward as we head into the rest of the work week. So 66 degrees today. While it's not the 71 that's typically around for June, we are still talking about closer to average than we will be the next several days. High pressure will push off to the east. Here comes this next area of low pressure. It looks promising, right? Here comes a warm front. Watch what happens. This low pressure goes down to the south, and as it does that, it keeps the warm weather to the south as well, and it brings some cool rain showers into the forecast Tuesday night and into Wednesday. Wednesday will be cool, a little bit on the rainy side, and we will have even a chance for an isolated thunderstorm. Not looking at severe weather because, again, we're too cold to be talking severe weather. So, again, today, enjoy what we've got. 67 degrees. Yes, it may be a little cool. You may need the jacket, but things are going to take a turn downward. 68 degrees in Waukesha today. 66, your afternoon high in Milwaukee. And then temps tonight, with the help of a nice little south-southeasterly wind, will not be quite as cold as what we woke up to this morning, but still 40s below average for June. And then we head into your Tuesday, and there comes that wind off the lake, keeping cooler at the lake 57 in Sheboygan tomorrow 64 in Waukesha with increasing cloud cover as that next weather maker approaches again the warm front dips down to the south so we stay cool 63 on Tuesday 61 with rain showers on Wednesday and keep the umbrella around for Thursday as well rain showers will come to an end most of us get about a quarter of an inch on Wednesday about a tenth of an inch on Thursday so about a half an inch total then some drier and slightly warmer air back in the forecast just in time for the weekend Saturday looks to be picture perfect 68 degrees with lots of sunshine we'll be right back